Finally, let's talk about the metaverse. In the last two years, we've seen how immersive experiences in gaming can help create community and connection. And we've also seen the proliferation of HoloLens scenarios across industries transforming everything from telehealth to remote maintenance to collaborative design and training. We are building out a diverse set of platform capabilities to help you build even richer applications that transcend both business and consumer scenarios and extend across all device platforms. Our approach starts, in fact, with Teams. With front row in Teams rooms, we are bringing people face-to-face, -face, placing remote attendees at eye level like they are in the same room. We're including hardware like intelligent cameras in meeting rooms for more natural, personal, and inclusive connections. And with the latest AI and Teams rooms experiences, we're dissolving the walls between digital and physical participation so people can present a PowerPoint together as though they were in the same location even when they're apart. Presence is the ultimate killer application. When you and I can remotely join the same meeting but feel like we are in the same room to create and collaborate together, that's finally within reach. I've been using Mesh for Teams internally, and I'm very excited with personal expressive avatars. My digital twin looks and interacts like me. It represents me the way I want to be seen, even when I don't have my camera on. I can interact with all of the artifacts in the meeting. Think about what that unlocks with product design as an example. Or I can drop into a persistent immersive space for more serendipitous meetups. Think of this as the office water cooler. And we'll have more to share as we open up these experiences in the coming months. And we're building Mesh as a platform service in Azure to enable you to build your own immersive worlds. You can build your metaverse experience on Mesh that are accessible from anywhere on any device, whether it's HoloLens, VR headsets, phones, tablets, or PCs. And we're taking this approach to ensure that developers are not bound to any one device platform. Take, for example, the experience WEF is showing at Davos this week. In partnership with Accenture, the experience they've built on Mesh educates people on their One Trillion Trees initiative to unite and promote reforestation efforts worldwide. The same paradigm shifts, the digitization of people, places, and things, and their interactions are also happening in the industrial metaverse. We're helping companies optimize their operations and automate, simulate, and predict every business function and process using IoT, digital twins, Mesh, and the HoloLens platform. And we see this in action today across every industry, from AB InBev, which is using our Metaverse stack to track every bottle from the wheat field through manufacturing to distribution, to Novo Nordisk, which is using mixed reality to optimize its pharmaceutical production while meeting regulatory requirements, and Marks and Spencers, which is using the data generated by every surface, screen, and scanner in their stores to track store performance and customer experience in real time. 